totally, 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 totally about my hair. So your girl decided that she wanted to do some crochet braids because, you know, I kind of got tired of the weaves and stuff like that and having to curl it and, and you know, flat iron it and all that other good stuff. But I just got really tired and I didn't want to wear my natural hair out either. I wanted to just, you know, braid it up and cover it up just because, I mean, you know, Ain't much you can do with it. Right now, it's not to a length where I'm like, oh, I could do this, I could do that with this. So I said, you know what? Let me get on YouTube and research some crochet braids. At first, I was like, yo, this hair is so big. It's super big. And I live in Florida. So the area that I live in, in my opinion, when they see something different, it's kind of like, You get the stare so I'm like you know whatever so I say you know what? I'm just gonna rock this hair out I don't care what anybody says or whatever I don't care about their opinion because this is my head so you ain't gotta wear it um the hair that I got was the realistic Marley braid times two 48 inch new afro twist by the company I think it's Bijou I don't know how you pronounce this bougie it says it's uh, compatible with 100% human hair premium fiber this is what the package looks like I just folded it in half you know what it looks like but I just folded it in half this is what the hair looks like and this hair was very very manageable it didn't give me any problems I didn't put any product on this hair I didn't put any type of conditioner anything like that all I did was I um, watched Katie K or Mary K. She's like the Mary K. Beautiful, beautiful um, young lady on YouTube who I've been watching for a little bit because you know she's like the crochet braid queen. There, and I just happened to walk into my um, beauty supply store and I was looking for the Femi brand of Marley hair, which they didn't have anymore. And I came across this, so I was like, oh, that is good, because you know what? I was like, oh, she used this hair. I used three packs of this hair. Um, I didn't cut the uh, Marley braid at all, didn't cut. All I did was I um, took the braid. I didn't, like I said, I didn't, I didn't cut it at all. I did kind of manipulate it a little bit, kind of spread it apart. As she did in her video, I'll link her video down below if you want to see how she did things. Um, and I just, she used smaller rods, but I used the bigger ones because I was kind of afraid how it might look with the tiny rods. But I think I'm going to try the tiny rods next time I plan to do this hairstyle. But these are the rods that I used. I used um, these rods, um, I dipped it, you know, I dipped it in hot water and so basically I pre-dipped before I did my crochet braid. Here's my latch hook. Got from Walmart. It's like a dollar ninety-nine I wanna say. And um, I'm not of course I didn't do a video showing you how I did it because there's plenty of uh, crochet braid videos you can look up. Feel free to do so. And um, that was it. That's all I did. All I <laughs> I unraveled each one and I crocheted them all in and um, that was it so that is all I really have on this hair I mean it's Marley braid so of course it's that nappy hair but you know all I do is um, cut the scragglies off you know some that are like if they're like you know kind of shaggy I kind of just cut them off which I have to do maybe every couple of days and how I tie up my hair, I do the banana. I flip my hair over, put, you know, and I tie it up into, a, it looks like a big, huge banana when I go to bed. And my son just keeps like, <laughs> you know, he thinks it's funny. That's it. I mean, what else can I say about this hair? It's just your normal Marley hair, but actually, I love the Femi brand, but I do like this one as well. They're kind of the same to me. Femi is very, very soft, and um, this one was very soft. It was not hard to ma manage at all. It was very easy to use, and um, I also take a, I took a little bit of olive oil, like when I first did it, and I kind of like, you know, rubbed it in a little bit, because I didn't want it to be super, super dry, 
but other than that that's it i really love it i mean it's big big hair big girl i don't know i mean i don't know what tell me what y'all think i mean i love it i think it's very cute let me show you the back if the back isn't too scraggly or raggly i don't know what it looks like back there And that's it, you guys. I mean, I just wanted to come on here and tell you, you know, about my hair, my new do that I'm going to be rocking for a little while. I want to keep this in at least a month. And, um, yeah, pretty much it. If you are interested in me doing a tutorial on this lovely look that I'm wearing today, even though I didn't go anywhere, thumbs up this video. Like, comment, subscribe, you know, share it with your friends. You know, I know you guys miss me, um, but, you know, I've been trying to get some things going here. But I'm back, though. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. For real, for real, for real. All right, I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Deuces.